Hi, I'm Tom Arndt. I am a manager of small to medium-sized companies in the automotive, machine tool, and industrial products industries. I have reinvigorated several companies. Uh, one was GenCorp Automotive, one was Beige Lubrication, and one was uh, Bridgeport Machine Tools. And uh, my expertise is reinvigorating companies uh, or reinventing companies in mature industries and restoring them to profitability and increased revenue. What do uh, leaders of businesses need to do today to handle a fast-moving and very volatile economy? Well, you've got to be quick and decisive. You've got to look at your competition, look at your, look at the, uh, the people who are making the buying decisions, understand what they want, and be able to respond quickly. Uh, it's very important that uh, you know it's speed. Speed is of the essence in terms of getting product in through and out of your manufacturing process, of responding to your customers, of being agile. You've got to be quick. I have five different aspects of my management philosophy. One is shoot the guy who shoots the messenger. You need people to escalate problems and ask for help. The first time you give a hard time to someone who does is the last time you will be asked for help. The second one is constructive criticism, then alignment. Uh, by that, I mean you should go through all of your ideas with your staff, but once you decide the course of action, the staff has to be aligned and function as a team. The third is you need to maintain your integrity, be of high integrity at all times with customers, with consumers, uh, with, uh, with, your, with your unions, with your employees. With your the fourth is you need to, uh, uh, I, I like to, Say, if you don't do, if you won't do it yourself, then don't do it. If an operation is not safe and you wouldn't do it, why should somebody else do it? If it's hard work to do a budget and you won't do it, why should somebody else do it? And last but not least, it has to be fun. Your team has to have a good time. You have to feel like you're making progress. Doesn't mean every day is a party, but it means over the long haul, you feel like you're growing as a person, you're growing as a company, and you're progressing as a group. Well, lean basically means. You make what the customer wants when he wants it. You don't make 50 if he wants five. Uh, you have to have the capability to make one or one at a time, one piece flow, and make it profitably and make it quickly, within the tack time necessary for that for that product and that product's demand. Uh, it also means that you eliminate non-value added effort. If the customer is not going to pay you for what you're doing. Uh, for example, uh, inspection after, after an assembly. If the customer is not going to pay for it, you need to figure out how to eliminate it. You need to focus on those things that add value. So you need, and you need to get it through, get it in, get it through, and get it out. You need to speed through the operation is critical. You'll find that the faster you do things, and uh, the faster you do them right, the less expense you're going to have in your product. So it's a function of those three principles it really makes a difference in terms of lean manufacturing.